I'm Gary Sinise. For many years, I've supported a variety of initiatives to help improve the lives of our veterans and military families. Now I'm pleased to be the spokesman for the National Medal of Honor Museum. You're about to take a tour of the Klan Museum and Education Center to be built on the eastern shore of Charleston Harbor in Mount Pleasant, South Carolina. You'll get a glimpse of the museum's stunning architecture, as well as the importance of the Medal of Honor in America's history. You will hear from Medal of Honor recipients who represent the nation's bravest and best, and from others who are working to make our vision a reality. They will share their thoughts on the significance of the medal and how the museum's exhibits and programs can educate and inspire new generations to place service above self by incorporating into their own lives the ideals and values the medal represents. The Medal of Honor is a very important award that is given to individuals who demonstrate above and beyond the call of duty, heroism, courage, and it is only given for valor that occurs on the battlefield. You know, the, the emotion that I had when I received it was, I was embarrassed. I'm standing there for what I did, something that so many people had done. It's not about me alone. There were 48 other Americans on the ground that day. It's our story. There's so many others that gave. The Medal of Honor symbolizes uh, not my service and sacrifice, but the service and sacrifice of all the young Marines and sailors. And it really is a, a true a reflection of what uh, enables us to be free people. not about great patriots uh, with incredible values, but it's about incredible values that are exhibited by great patriots. And that's, that's really what the whole concept of the museum is about conveying. You know, throughout the country, we have places where Medal of Honor recipients are recognized, but nowhere in this country is it all brought together in one place to demonstrate what ordinary people can do in the extraordinary when they place service above self. This is a, a time for us to influence, really make uh, young people feel that they can contribute. So if we do that, uh, I can say we've accomplished the mission. <laughs>